And now a story you'll only see here on Five. There's trouble in Tremont. Tonight, neighbors tell us Cleveland isn't following its own street codes. And they say all you have to do is look at the crumbling infrastructure to see what they mean. Our Derek Waller spent today investigating the claims. And Derek, neighbors are really worried that this is stifling development. Yeah, you know, Danita, there is millions of dollars in development that's happening in this western section of Tremont, but head a little further west toward Ohio City, and you still have some blight. We have an abandoned building here, crumbling sidewalks, and past this property is a city-owned lot that they are not taking care of. How do you get city departments, perhaps, to site their own city? to provide sidewalks. Lincoln Heights Block Club President Henry Sinyak says this torn up section of sidewalk on Wiley Avenue is just the beginning of a list of streets with poor infrastructure. We even saw one woman skip the sidewalk and use the street instead. Other nearby streets are filled with potholes, all as developers have announced tens of millions of dollars in new apartments and condos along Scranton Road. He wants the city to pay attention. To make sure we can get all new sidewalks, uh, all of our streets are taken care of because most of them are in deplorable condition. But with all the amount of private development, it's time for the, the city to step up. And Senyak points out that if that lot were a private lot, they could be cited by the city, maybe even taken to housing court. I did reach out to the city's sidewalk department today, but was told nobody was available to speak. Live in Tremont, Derek Waller, News Channel 5.